Here are some quick instructions for participating in an eComms module as a tester. On the left frame of the home page, click on the module that you've been asked to test. In the left navigation frame, all the pages of this module are displayed. Notice the essential question in the center block. After reviewing everything on the first page of the module, move to the Tester Agreement tab. Click here and complete the Tester Agreement. After completing the Tester Agreement, move on to the Meet and Greet page and begin your online connection with your colleagues. Next, answer the questions in the pre-module self-evaluation. Your answers are confidential. You will be asked the same set of questions at the end of the module. Next, you will move on to week one. After reviewing the guiding question for the week, you will work your way through the Explore, Make It Work, and Share sections on the left-hand frame. Don't forget that on the right-hand frame, you will find downloadable resources and web resources that relate to that page. These resources are particularly helpful if you discover a link not working within the main body of the instructions. In the Make It Work section, you will find three or four options. Read them all, and then do the one that makes the most sense for you. The discussions begin in the Explore section and complete in the Share section where you upload your Make It Work artifact and share your learning with your colleagues. At the end of each week, be sure to complete the Tester Feedback Survey. The eComms modules are designed to complete within a six-week period. The recommended model is to use Monday and Tuesdays for Explore, Wednesdays through Fridays for the Make It Work sections, and Saturday and Sunday to wrap things up with your colleagues in the Share section. Don't forget the Help blocks in the right-hand frame. There is where you will let us know if you are having technical issues. And we appreciate you doing that as you are our testers. The final week of the module has a different structure. First, following the instructions, you create a final artifact as evidence of your learning. You upload the artifact and complete the module discussion with your colleagues. Then you complete the post-module self-evaluation and the final test feedback survey which is unique to week six. If you are wanting to receive a continuing education unit from the university, you follow the instructions on that page. The very last tab in the navigation frame is called Module Resources. It contains a downloadable zip file of all resources. Thank you for completing this eComms module on Science Inquiry.